So, today, it's nearly Christmas, it's the end of November, so we are going to Manchester, to the Christmas markets, um, so that should be good, we're going to have a wander around, we're going to go and check out the stalls that they've got, and it's not Connie's first time to Manchester, she's been there twice, because we went to Manchester for her photo shoot on her first birthday, and a newborn photo shoot we had there at the same place. So she's been to Manchester, but she's never been Manchester Christmas Market, so it's going, hopefully, to be a fun day. So we're going to go and check that out. Um, I don't know if she's excited there, but, yeah, we're all looking forward to it. So, yeah, let's go and check it out. And fun fact, it's the first place that Gemma and I met in person. It's the first time we met, and our first date was Manchester Christmas Market. So let's go check it out. So rather than fighting our way through the hustle and bustle of Manchester city centre in the car trying to find somewhere to park and it being heavily congested we drove to Altrincham tram station because we're going to get on a tram and then we're going to get the tram into Manchester and it's just a lot easier and also it's an experience for Connie because it'll be her first time on a tram um, and the tram's pretty cool actually so yeah we're at Altrincham station now Altrincham station and we're going to jump the tram into Manchester and go check out the Christmas markets. And as always, Madam Connie is asleep. So we're going to try and wake her up and get on the tram. Come on. So, 
I've just found a stall called the Bearded Feeder, which is Star Wars themed, and they do some epic looking food. Look at that. I went for the Old Ben, which is a barbecue pulled pork, and I got Gemma, the Solo, which is just the cheeseburger, and I got Connie some chips. So, yeah, we're gonna have this. And then we're going to go and have a look around a bit more, but it is so wild, so busy today. Isn't it, mate? So busy. <laughs> place to be this Christmas so it may be as maybe the reason as to why it's so busy but ironically it's not jolly and it's not the best when it's so busy so <laughs> oh well you enjoying your chips little mate they're nice get some Christmas chippies this is absolutely barbaric this is so busy what the hell so the plan was to come this weekend because it isn't quite December so when expected to be busy but I think everyone else has took the same approach because <laughs> it's so busy We're on the Titanic, got the Titanic theme tune playing. <laughs> We're all on this sinking ship. This is mental, man. Barely made it through that one as well. Honestly, God, it doesn't uh, it doesn't make it easy going through the crowds like that. And it definitely dampens the festive spirit. To be honest, I wanted to come and get a curry waste and get a nice um, German lager and a mulled wine, but you can't even get served. There's absolutely no chance of getting served. It's so busy. So um, I think what we'll do is go and see what we can of the lights. There's a big Santa Claus. So we'll go and check that out, we'll show Connie. Um, and then I think we'll probably look to start getting back home, make our way back, because it's just so busy. It's crazy. But everyone's having a good time anyway. They're all singing and dancing. So, yeah. Come on. Right, it's getting dark, 
it's still extremely busy and it's getting a bit nippy it's quite cold so we're gonna get the tram back home and then we're gonna call it a day Toot. and then we are gonna plan the next adventure and I think the next adventure is probably gonna be the Christmas markets in Liverpool um, they're pretty good hopefully they're not gonna be as busy and I might actually get a curry waste um, so we'll check them out but yeah let's go